What if I told you that with just a few clicks, you could find almost anyone online and all for free? Today, I'm going to show you the top secret tools that hackers and investigators use to uncover anything about anyone. Let's dive in and explore these powerful tools. First up, let's dive into Maltego, a powerhouse tool designed to visually map out the intricate web of connections between data points. Whether you're a cybersecurity enthusiast, an investigator, or just curious about how information is linked online, Maltego is your go-to platform for uncovering hidden relationships. Picture this. You're looking at a digital spider web that reveals how a person is connected to their friends, their workplace, social media accounts, and even obscure online traces you'd never expect to find. Let's say we begin with something as simple as a company's domain name. With just a few clicks, Maltego starts pulling in DNS records, IP addresses, and even other domains that are linked behind the scenes. It's like peeling back the layers of the internet to see what's really going on underneath. Watching Maltego work is like seeing a detective's corkboard magically assemble itself in real time, with every new clue instantly connected to the bigger picture. Starting from a single domain, you can trace the path to email addresses, then leap to social media profiles, and before you know it, you've uncovered entire networks that were hidden in plain sight. It's a treasure hunt for digital connections. The best part? Maltego's Community Edition is completely free to download and use. It's robust enough to launch your OSINT journey, whether you're a beginner or a seasoned pro. Once you start using it, you'll find it's almost addictive. The thrill of uncovering connections makes you feel like you're starring in your own high-tech spy movie, piecing together clues from the shadows. With Maltego, you can investigate companies, map out the digital footprint of public figures, or even analyze your own online presence to see what's out there. What really sets Maltego apart is its ability to take mountains of messy, unstructured data and transform it into a clean, organized chart that anyone can understand at a glance. For anyone serious about open source intelligence, Maltego isn't just a tool, it's an essential part of your digital toolkit trusted by professionals worldwide. It's all about turning raw, scattered data into actionable intelligence, helping you build a compelling case from just a single clue or lead. And this is just the beginning. The world of OSINT tools is vast, and the next ones we'll explore are even more powerful and mind-blowing. Up next, get ready to see a tool that vacuums up emails and subdomains at lightning speed, almost like a digital black hole sucking in every piece of data it can find. Stay tuned! Next on our list is the Harvester, a powerful open source tool designed for gathering emails, subdomains, and a variety of other valuable information from public sources across the internet. It's a favorite among cybersecurity professionals and ethical hackers alike, thanks to its versatility and ease of use. The Harvester scours the internet, searching through countless websites, databases, and public records to collect preliminary information about a target organization. This process, known as open source intelligence gathering, is a crucial first step in both penetration testing and real-world cyber attacks. Let's run the Harvester on a target domain and watch as it quickly gathers a list of potential employee emails and subdomains. With just a few commands, you can uncover a surprising amount of data that would otherwise take hours or even days to find manually. This information is gold for an attacker. Each email address represents a potential entry point for phishing attacks, spear phishing campaigns, or even brute force attempts. The more emails you have, the more opportunities you create for a successful breach. The Harvester automates the tedious manual work of searching through hundreds of web pages, forums, and online directories, completing in seconds what would take a human hours to accomplish. It aggregates data from multiple sources, like search engines, social networks, and public databases, into one clean, organized report, making analysis much easier and more efficient. Hackers and penetration testers use these lists of emails and subdomains to plan social engineering campaigns, map out an organization's digital footprint, and identify potential weak points in their security posture. The more you know about your target, the easier it becomes to find a weak spot. Information is power, and the Harvester puts a lot of it at your fingertips. Best of all, the Harvester is completely free and comes pre-installed on Kaylee Linux, the go-to operating system for cybersecurity professionals. For pure, raw data collection on a specific domain, the Harvester is an essential tool in any investigator's arsenal, providing a solid foundation for deeper analysis. It's fast, efficient, and gives you a huge head start in any investigation, whether you're defending your own network or testing someone else's. Now imagine if you could automate this process across hundreds of sources at once, 
scaling your reconnaissance to an entirely new level. The next tool on our list does exactly that. Stay tuned. Spiderfoot automates intelligence gathering from over 200 data sources. It collects data from social media, dark web forums, public records, and more. You start a scan, enter your target, and select which modules to run. Spiderfoot queries all its sources simultaneously, mapping out data and connections. It finds things you never thought to look for, like old forum posts and leaked passwords. The sheer amount of information it uncovers is staggering. Spiderfoot's modularity and automation save an incredible amount of time. The free version is capable, while the paid version offers more features. If you want to automate your OSINT gathering, Spiderfoot is the tool you need. It's a true force multiplier. Shodan is often called the search engine for hackers, but it's much more than that. It's a powerful tool that scans the entire internet, searching for devices that are connected online. Everything from computers and servers to smart fridges and security cameras. Unlike Google, which indexes websites, Shodan crawls the internet for things like webcams, traffic lights, industrial control systems, and even home automation devices. It reveals just how many everyday objects are online, often without people realizing it. Instead of searching with keywords, you use powerful filters to narrow down your search for specific devices, locations, or vulnerabilities. This makes it possible to find exactly what you're looking for, whether it's a certain type of server or a device in a particular country. Shodan provides banner information for each device it finds. This often includes technical details like the brand, model, software version, and sometimes even the device's configuration or status. Security researchers rely on Shodan to discover vulnerable systems that might be exposed to the internet. By identifying these weaknesses, they can help organizations fix security holes before attackers exploit them. For example, you can search for databases that are open to the internet without a password, which is a common mistake that can lead to massive data breaches if left unchecked. Shodan is vital for understanding the ever-growing landscape of the Internet of Things. It shows just how many smart devices are online and how interconnected our world has become. While a free Shodan account gives you a limited number of searches and results, upgrading to a paid plan unlocks advanced features, more search results, and deeper access to the data Shodan collects. For IT security professionals, Shodan is a vital tool for defensive security. It helps them monitor their networks, spot exposed devices, and stay ahead of potential threats. System administrators use Shodan to regularly check their own networks for devices that might be accidentally exposed to the public internet, helping them secure their infrastructure. But remember, if you can find a device on Shodan, so can a malicious attacker. That's why it's so important to secure your devices and monitor what's visible online. Whether you're an ethical hacker, a security analyst, or just curious about what's online, Shodan is an essential tool for both offensive and defensive security research, giving you a unique window into the hidden side of the internet. Google dorking is the art of using advanced search operators to find hidden information. You can find file types, uncover login pages, and more. Let's try a few simple dorks, like searching within a specific website. The operator is powerful for finding specific documents. Attackers use this to find potential targets for brute force attacks. The Google Hacking Database is a repository of these dorks. It's maintained by Offensive Security, the people behind Kaylee Linux. Google dorking is one of the first skills any OSINT investigator should learn. It's free, easy, and incredibly effective. A few well-crafted Google searches can give you a massive amount of information. Sometimes the simplest tools are the most powerful. Spend time learning these operators and you'll change the way you see Google forever. Recon Eng is a full-fledged framework for open source intelligence gathering. It's a platform with different modules for specific tasks. You operate within a workspace, adding information to a database, run modules to find employee names, social media profiles, and more. Recon Eng has a marketplace for installing modules. Some modules interact with APIs from other services. It centralizes data gathering into one powerful command line interface. This tool is for advanced users requiring a learning curve. Once mastered, the level of automation and customization is unparalleled. For serious OSINT professionals, Recon NG is a cornerstone of their toolkit. Have I Been Pewiend lets you check if your email has been compromised in a data breach. It's a simple but critically important tool for personal security. Type in your email and it cross-references against billions of records. It tells you which breaches your account was found in. If your email was in a breach, change your passwords immediately. 
Have I Been PD Owned also notifies you of future breaches. It's a free early warning system that can save you from trouble. This tool is useful for personal security and OSINT investigations. Check your own email now. Social Searcher is a real-time search engine for social media. Search for keywords, hashtags, or usernames across platforms. It's a powerful way to monitor public posts and sentiment. Filter results by network, sentiment, or content type. Save searches and set up email alerts for ongoing investigations. For finding people, search for a username to find all their profiles. Use advanced search filters to narrow down results. The free version is powerful, with premium plans for more analytics. Creepy is a geolocation intelligence tool that plots location data on a map. It gathers data from social media and image hosting services. Enter a target's username and Creepy finds posts with location data. It presents a map showing where your target has posted from. This is a huge privacy concern as many people unknowingly share location data. Creepy highlights the danger of exposing location information. It's a powerful educational tool for digital privacy and OPSEC. From an investigator's point of view, it's incredibly powerful. Sherlock is a command line tool that searches for a username across hundreds of sites. It's useful for building a complete profile of a target. People often reuse the same username across platforms. Sherlock is fast and thorough, providing direct links to profiles. Investigators can gather more information from these links. It's a great tool for doxing yourself to see your digital footprint. Sherlock is open source and constantly updated by the community. And there you have it. 10 powerful free OSINT tools to find almost anything online. The internet is a massive ocean of information and these tools are your fishing rods. Use these tools ethically and only for legal purposes. The goal is to educate you on what's possible and help you protect yourself. Use this knowledge for good, whether for cybersecurity research or investigative journalism. Thank you for watching. If you learned something new, hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. Let me know in the comments which tool was your favorite. Stay curious and I'll see you in the next video.